Well, a lot of people in the valley are beginning to feel the effects of the fall allergy season, even though we're not necessarily seeing fall temperatures yet. Allergy experts say the culprit might not be what you think it is. 27 First News reporter Jason Surjack spoke with experts to find out how you can best avoid suffering through allergies this season. The old saying may be, April showers bring May flowers, but for this time of the year, it's more like summer rains bring fall allergies. And experts say that this year is one of the worst in recent memory. Uh, we're, we're seeing it in our patients, huge amounts of allergies, symptoms coming in with horrible uh, upper respiratory infections as well. Many different weeds bloom this time of year, and those that suffer from allergies often blame the wrong plant. A common misnomer is that beautiful yellow flower you see this time of year. Goldenrod is what's causing your allergies, your head to kind of get stopped up, but the real offender is ragweed. With late summer weeds in bloom all over the Midwest, experts say that removing weeds from your yard can only do so much. Dr. Khan prescribes keeping the outdoors outside as much as possible. Keep your windows closed and uh, the second is that if you have air conditioning in the house it's really nice to, to help filter out some of those particles. Ragweed is a prolific pollen producer with each plant producing up to a billion pollen spores each. So experts say that frequent cleaning is the best defense against allergy symptoms. But the biggest thing is going into the house after you're done, enjoying nature, enjoying the garden, and cleaning up as much as you can. In Canfield, Jason Surjack, WKBN 27 First News.